Hello Earth Signs, Virgo Taurus and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out who has been thinking heavily about you lately and why. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. Today is the 8th of March, 2023. Time here in Marseille. France is 1.10 p.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Earth Signs and if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you even if you're dealing with the same Earth Sign. Alright, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and Angels, please show me for Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus and Capricorn. Who has been thinking heavily about Earth Signs lately and why? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person. The Fool at the bottom of the uh, deck. So this person could be an Aries, could be a Virgo, Taurus, uh, Capricorn, somebody like you are. Um, we've got the United Wands in reverse, could be a fire sign as well. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Capricorn. This person, look at the devil here. They're obsessively thinking about you. Maybe because they currently feel rejected by you. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. And they have been keeping tabs on you. Um, it could be Googling you, could be looking at your social media or wondering how you're doing. I feel like this, this person feels rejected by you or, you know, again, it could go vice versa. Either this person has re rejected you or you may have rejected this person at one point in time, but it has already happened, okay? This, sit, this is sitting in your past position. So the star here is in first. So this person has been thinking heavily in regards of something that may have happened between the two of you where it needs healing and recovery. Four of Cups, maybe this is someone you're kind of dissatisfied with currently. Um, something has happened, right? Maybe feelings were hurt. Something has happened where I feel that Earth Signs, if you're the one rejecting this person, you're the one who has rejected this person, it feels like rightfully so because of the devil here maybe this person has done something that was totally unfair to you or the whole situation was just unfair could be because of selfishness because the devil you know anything that is too much is toxic it can be anything indulgences toxicities selfishness controlling behavior possessiveness addictions, abuse, can be any of these things. So neither ones here as in lovers. For some reason, I feel like there could be a couple of people currently thinking heavily about you right now, earth signs. Uh, another one would be a fire sign. So there's fire, there's earth, and there's also Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, which is air. It could be two or three people here, okay? Unless all, all of these three are the same person. It could, it could be, it doesn't matter. Sometimes, even if we have multiple court cards, it doesn't mean that there are multiple people. It could indicate just this person embodying these few characters here, okay? But what I'm seeing right now, Earth Signs, is that maybe hmm, this person is thinking heavily about you, right? Because you are not really wanting to talk to them that much or not wanting to pay them too much attention. Um, I think this person is wondering if you also have somebody else. If you're talking to somebody else, there's a suspicious energy here, right? Page of Swords is always suspicious. I feel like with the Ten of Cups, Six of Swords, and the Knight of Pentacles, look at the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. Both of them are actually looking at each other. So on the down low, this person will be thinking heavily about you right now because they wondered if they could have competition, okay? If, they have, if you have somebody else or if they have a competition or maybe they're feeling competitive with you, that's for some of you because these two, even though are in reverse, but they're looking at each other and 
with the Page of Swords right next to King of Wands, if you look at the way the cards interact with each other, he or she is like looking at these two here, like suspicious about do I have competition? Yeah, so this person could be feeling kind of insecure as well because the devil can indicate insecurities. They could also be thinking heavily in regards to the future, Ten of Cups, if both of you have a future together, if both of you will get back together, reconcile, um, just future in, in general, it feels like Ten of Cups also can indicate happily ever after. Will they be happy with you? Are you happier without them? Or have you already found your happiness elsewhere, okay? So Six of Swords, this is someone I feel maybe for some of you, you just find this person to be unhealthy for you in some way, shape or form and this is someone you have decided or in the midst of deciding to maybe walk away and look for your own happiness elsewhere, right? Because this is uh, Earth signs, this Knight of Pentacles is you, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, right? So it could also be the other person, but if this is you, would it be in reverse? It feels like you may not be fully invested in this person. You may think that you, you, you may be thinking that once upon a time, maybe this person could have shown you some sort of like as if they were genuine, as if they were committed to your friendship. It could be a friendship or it could be a romantic connection. And, but feels like would it be in reverse? It's something that I think are signs. Some of you, you may have decided, you know, maybe this person is not going to give me what he or she said they were going to give to me. Maybe there is, you know, lack of stability, lack of honoring one's word, uh, one's words. <laughs> okay, so, but I feel like earth signs for a lot of you, maybe this is someone you have already felt I think you're dissatisfied with this person full of cups. You're not really wanting to deal with them currently. You've been showing dissatisfaction in some way, shape or form that you're still hurting. Or maybe this person is still hurting and they're dissatisfied about something. If they're ignoring you, if, if the shoe is on the other foot, if they're ignoring you, um, doesn't mean that they're not thinking about you. They definitely still are, you know, with the Page of Swords here in reverse, still keeping taps on you. See, look at the Ace of Pentacles here in reverse. This connection started off strong, like it was going somewhere. It just didn't take off. And the Knight of Pentacles in reverse didn't take off. So this satisfaction about somebody's, um, in it's like initially it looked promising, yeah. But then it didn't take off. Maybe something was being realized. Something was being seen here with the devil. There's some insecurities, a fear, possessiveness, or it could be any of these things. But I feel like all third party situation, lying, cheating, not honoring one's words again, like making promises with the star here, like promising the stars and the, what do you call, the stars in the sky you know, being all romantic and then boom, reality sets in and that's not really that case. So, but this person has been thinking heavily in regards of, again, Ten of Cups, if both of you would end up still being together, continue being together or getting back together if both of you are separated. Thinking heavily in regards of Six of Swords, you leaving or you have already left about how you're dissatisfied with them and you have already left or thinking about leaving them. They still want to know if you're interested. And we've got the Fool right here. Two of Cups in reverse. Yeah, this is someone you are separated from. Ace of Cups or some disagreements between two of you not seeing eye to eye, not being on the same page. They could be thinking heavily in regards of will can both of you actually have this new start, right, with the Fool? Can both of you take a new leap of faith? Will there be a reconciliation or will there be a happily ever after? An Ace of Cups right here. They could be feeling like they do love you, they do have 
feelings for you or develop new romantic feelings for you. And seven of swords here is in reverse. And we're thinking heavily in regards of how you've caught them, right? You've told them something that was true. Um, that they may or may not have known prior to this. But basically being caught in action, seven of swords in reverse, or true colors have been revealed and it ain't that pretty, right? So this is either someone that you have caught them or you have seen their true colors and then it didn't work out. Earth signs, maybe you've decided, you know what? I'm not happy with what I'm seeing right now. What I have, what I have caught or realized about someone, about this person, and then you have decided or on your way to walking away from this person. So this person could be thinking heavily in regards of you letting this connection go and you possibly could be on your way to looking for someone else, Ace of Cups, or searching for a new love, searching for your own happiness elsewhere. Let me pull out a few of these oracles here. I'm becoming a better person. So this person could be thinking heavily in regards of how things need to change. Maybe they need to make some changes or that you need to make some changes. It could go vice versa. I left when I saw you with someone. I feel like this has more to do with this person like suspecting you may have someone else. Just being near to you is intoxicating. So this um, devil here indicates that this person be thinking heavily about you right now because they are attracted to you. They want you. Or that they want to be close to you but there's something that's not vibing here um earth signs something that is again unhealthy i feel you even though we are apart maybe both of you are separated right now and they still thinking they could still be thinking about you i wish i could take back my words they may have agreed to something said something that they are regretting and maybe they would like to make some changes here uh, with the I am becoming a better person. I do sense some regrets here. Earth signs, this person could be thinking heavily in regards of certain words, certain things that they have said, actions they have taken that I think they could be regretting. All right, um, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, this is your reading, and I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Um, feel free to subscribe to both of my channels, Chelsea Love Tarot, which is my original channel, and Chelsea Tarot 2.0, my newest channel. All right, Earth Signs, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. I've been having, I've been receiving uh, some complaints saying that they were not being notified every time when I post my videos. All right, take care. Virgo, Taurus, and Capcom. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Bye.